They've been very good just getting it up in transition. Um, you can just see Ohio State is, is not helping in the post. They, they're worried about that three ball. Averaging 11 points per game, blocked by McNeil and kept in play. Thornton there to start it up the floor. You mentioned early, it's important to stay in front of the, the, the offensive player. Good block by McNeil, and they get the easy hoop on the transition. Yeah, you have a different team. Pretty A team, is, as uh, Coach Holtman talked to us at the shoot-around, that he was worried about some athleticism and some size. Oh, count the bucket and a chance at a three-point play. Omari Peak. He's a rebounder. He gets assists. He's, he's a really good defender. Can guard a lot of positions. Suing with the turnover. Tucker to the other oh. end. And what a challenge. Roddy Gale, Jr. Eight to shoot for Hicks. They took Thornton out, give him a little bit of a breather. I talked about how many minutes he's played, and then you have Suing at the point guard. Probably not the flow that they're used to. Going inside out, they tried to double. Good, good read. Oh, the sixth block for the Buckeyes. Key soaring in for the swap. Thompson working in some trouble. Feeds it to Williams. Just got the shot up. No, but an offensive rebound for Powell. Here's Thompson's three. It'll fall, and it's a one-point game. And Likely will bring it up. Likely leaving for Key, run into the lane. One for five from three. Those are his only misses today, those from long range. And they were good looks. I, not like they were forced ones. Oh, nice find for Suing to get the two-hand flush. Well designed off halftime. Uh, can really, really shoot the basketball. 155 threes in his time with the Mountaineers. Tough shot for Garrett Hicks, but the leading scorer for the Bulldogs back on the board. He's got nine. Thornton penetrates, gets the rule, and a chance for one more at the line. Para with a rebound. Second chance for Ohio State. Ten offensive rebounds now for the Buckeyes, and they cash in with Sensabaugh's first bucket of the second half. A good call out of the timeout. Again, they started the half with a little play and got an easy hoop, and now the three. Downey with the answer. Lorenzo Downey. Snaps an 8-0 Buckeye run. Bulldogs fourth in the country in three-point percentage coming in. Last year, second to last in the nation. Just 27% from three. But players like Garrett Hicks and their improvement. So now you have Gale and Likely both in there at the same time shaking off that rust. Yeah, it, it's it's important. And then you got a drop inside by Sensible. He's got 15. Second chance for the Bulldogs, and the three won't go. Rebound in the hands of Gale. And now Gale up ahead. Nice feed to uh, Give them some versatility. Again, I talked about their... Oh, my. Got a nice little foul out of up there. Out of nowhere. Bruce Thornton looking to work. Oh, Cameron Tucker, point guard starter a year ago for this squad, feeding inside, and Akinobi rattles the rim once more. Three. Likely the touch to Sensiball for three. He knew that was true. Likely the assist, Sensiball, his second from deep. Likely looking over his shoulder, lobbing it up for Akpara. The tip won't go, a little bit off on the timing, and now the bounce ahead to a running Omari Peak. Peak scoop shot up and in. Never know with a concussion. Everybody heals differently from that. Yeah, and, and you've had, we see it in football now. The quarterback at Miami, it's so dangerous. You, you know, they've had struggles here in the second half, but when they get in conference, I think they're going to be a handful. Sensible. Speaking of handfuls, Sensible. 21 for Sensible. Getting some depth, playing with different lineups, and as you deal with this, Next 18 games. Yeah. like that, it'll be a big difference. The kick ahead. Kobe Bauman not able to get that one to go. Bounce ahead now on the other end and a two-hand flush for Jalen Randall. Good win for the Buckeyes. Good second half. Um, now, now the real stuff starts with the Big Ten. Northwestern on the road Sunday on the Big Ten Network.